Six, if you're looking to get out and exercise while raising awareness for a good cause, you can participate in the Reduce Your Risk Breast Cancer Walk. That's happening tomorrow at the Hub. We have Lisa Ann Wheeler with the Georgia Department of Public Health, mm -hmm. as well as the Reduce Your Risk team, Angela Prince and Carolyn Bird, in with us this morning. Good Thank morning, you. ladies. Good morning. Good morning. Um, Lisa Ann, before we actually get to the walk itself, which is mm -hmm. happening tomorrow, please tell us about your breast and cervical cancer screening program. Yes, this program is through the Georgia Department of Public Health. It's for women who are uninsured and low income. We bring them into the health department. They have a comprehensive exam. We cover the PAP, HPV, mammogram. We cover all of that. It's at no cost to the patient as long as they qualify for the program. All right, and Angela, you and Carolyn are both uh, breast cancer survivors. Um, talk to us briefly about the importance of sharing this information, not just in October, but year round. Right, so we kind of got together um, because I'm a breast cancer survivor, 2015, stage four. Um, I was very scared and there's other signs of breast cancer. And if I was educated on what those signs were, um, I probably would have found it sooner, but I wasn't educated. Right. So that's why we really need to have an emphasis on educating every month um, our young people, um, older people, just everybody needs to know what those signs are. And that, you know, of course October is important because for breast cancer awareness, but we really need to be aware every month. It's important. And here you are raising that awareness every month through multiple <coughs> events. Carolyn, talk to us about the Breast Cancer Walk happening tomorrow. What can people expect? <laughs> so we have this walk, like I said, monthly in different areas of the CSRA. So on tomorrow, we will have it at the hub, and we will actually walk around the hub. You walk at your own pace. And one of the things that we know that exercise will reduce your risk of breast cancer. So that's why we're um, raising that awareness to come out monthly. And, and, and again, my, I found my cancer five months after a clean mammogram, um, and I found it myself. So the thing is, you know, you may think you're good from one year to the next. That may not be true. So that's why it's important of being aware of your breast every month. Um, so that you will know it's something different and something changes. So we would love for everyone to come out tomorrow and be a part mm -hmm. of our walk. Now, including the walk, there is also going to be a cooking class that's going to be happening right after the walk. Lisa Ann, uh, what was the decision to incorporate this with the event? So this is part of Reduce Your Risk. This is what we, we were talking about. Right. You know, healthy eating, reducing your stress, exercise, and sleep. Good portion of that is just eating right. So Chef Dahl from Helms College, who is amazing, she's coming tomorrow to cook up something fabulous for us. Um, you know, cooking class and a little bit of breast health information, too. Very cool. So you have a walk and then also an educational cooking class. Angela, I'm going to come back to you. What do you want the message to be to not only the participants tomorrow, but just everyone at home? Really to just put yourself first sometimes. Um, I was a working mother. I had children. I, I was so busy and my lump just grew and grew and I kind of like avoided it. I just thought, you know, I need to take care of everybody else. Right. And I wasn't really focusing on myself until it was, you know, stage four. So um, we really need to think about our health and ourselves yeah. first so we can take care of everybody else and be here to take care of everybody else. Mm -hmm. uh, let's go ahead and get the particulars and details for the event, uh, for the walk and the cooking class tomorrow, Lisa. Okay, so for the walk, it's 9.30 to 10.30. It's at the hub. And then the cooking class will follow at 11 to 12.30. Okay, and uh, the walk is free. Oh yes, both are free. Right. The walk and the cooking class. You do need to sign up for the cooking class because we only have, it's limited space. Okay, and yes. where can people go for more information or to RSVP for the cooking class? So you can follow us on our Facebook page, Reduce Your Risk, Inc. All of our um, signage is there. Um, information on our walks. Um, we do this, do this every month. And the cooking class sign-up is also on Facebook. Yes. All right. Thank, thank you, ladies. Very absolutely. Right, thank thanks you. for having us. Great time yeah. for a great cause. Lisa, yeah, yeah, Angela, absolutely. Carolyn, thanks so much for joining thank us. Thank you. Thank you.